Right, this is CTT amplifier from 4 to 8 gigahertz rated, but it's actually doing 3 to 8 gigahertz. Very nice fre frequency response here. With 40 dB gain and 33 uh, dBm output, it's 2 watt output. So currently we see the sweeping across the range and the output is uh, connected to, through an attenuator of 10 dB attenuator. So what we see here is a minus 8 and the input is minus 40 uh, dBm. So let's uh, push the, let's uh, just select one of the frequencies, let's say uh, um, center of 6 gigahertz, uh, to a preset, uh, put a center of uh, say 6 gigahertz with a span of 1 gigahertz here and put here CW of 6 gigahertz this is my frequency here Oops, let's okay take it out okay so this is the 6 gigahertz and put the attenuator on put the earth level down and let's start push the power so currently we see 8 dBm, it's actually 18 because we have the attenuator here, don't forget. So the current is uh, 1.8 uh, amps. So let's push it more to minus 10 CW minus 10 dBm at the input. So we got 18, so it's actually 28 to minus 5. So it's now 22, which is 32 because the 10 dBm here. And do minus uh, 3 push it so now it's uh, 23 so actually it's 33 uh, dBm as it should be it's 2 watt output and it is all across the range from 3 to uh, 8 gigahertz 2 watts output with a 40 dB gain very nice RF amplifier heatsink included as you can see so already have the heatsink ready to use you can find this and other test equipment in uh, our web store at uh, eBay thank you